So we're now going to look at A-level computer science. So Mr. Sturdy is the head of computer science. Um, and I've just put together a, uh, he's put together a, a kind of a slide on what A-level computer science is all about. So A-level computer science is a practical subject where you apply the academic principles learned in the classroom to real world systems. So you will learn the theory of computing, but also how to apply that to real world scenarios. You will develop an understanding and ability to apply the fundamental principles of computing, including abstraction, decomposition, logic, algorithms, and data representation, which some of you will recognize from GCSE. You will analyze problems um, through practical experience. So you will build your own programs uh, through coding. You will code your own programs to solve real life, real life problems. You will um, look at kind of how the different aspects of the subject of computer science tie in with each other. And you will also develop skills such as creativity, innovation, uh, innovative thinking, analytical thinking, logical thinking, and critical thinking. And also mathematical skills. All of these skills, the kind of critical thinking, problem solving, are highly, highly relevant um, for employers at the moment. You will study for two exam papers and one coursework project. So the first exam paper is called Computer Systems. And it's all about um, kind of the physical side of the computer. So looking at processors, looking at software development, looking at algorithms, and also looking at the legal, moral, and cultural issues. So things around data privacy, hacking, and environmental issues. The second paper is about programming. So you'll be kind of handwriting your own programs and working out how to solve problems. And the programming project is your coursework project where you will create a, create a program to solve a real life solution. And all of these kind of pull together all the skills that employers are really, really um, looking for at the moment. So why should you choose it? The skills you develop are highly transferable to almost any career or any other course at university. So if you choose A-level computing, you will not just kind of learn the skills ready for a computer science degree. Um, it's a broad course, so it covers not just, if you're interested in programming, it covers programming. But if you're less interested in programming and more interested about the physical hardware side of a computer, you will learn about that. You'll learn about cybersecurity, networking, and lots of other relevant topics. It will give you a good insight if you are thinking about taking it at university. Um, so if you're kind of thinking about computing for a university, but you're not 100% sure, it will give you a good idea as to what a university degree might be like. And also, if you know you don't, don't want to do it at university, but you still enjoy it as a subject and you think it's really important, you could take it as an A-level, which is a really highly respected qualification, and then pick another subject at degree level, and it will still provide you with the skills to do whatever subject you want to do, um, such as music production, media, not just programming and coding. It's a creative subject as well as a mathematical subject. Some of the career opportunities you can do with computing. So you could be a programmer for a large technology company. You might become a project manager that oversees a big kind of IT project for any for any business. Any business is going to need um, IT support. You might go into banking and finance. Um, ha around half of the finance and banking sectors at the moment are actually computer scientists, not bankers. And... Many people with A-level computing will go on to study it at university or study a similar subject at university. There are things like video game design. Like I said, you could do uh, music production, music technology, media, uh, maths, robotics. Whatever you go into, A-level computing will provide you with the skills um, that will help you to succeed in that, in that chosen pathway. Uh, that's it from me.